Hi, welcome to the show. Yo! This is family friendly. I went to España this weekend. Ooh. Ah. Ooh. Hi again and welcome to 3 Minute Jones. And now, the news. Will Instagram IGTV become the next YouTube? After reaching 1 billion monthly users, Instagram has launched IGTV last week, which is the new platform for creators that want to upload videos with the length between 50 seconds and 60 minutes. Until now, the app only allowed 1 minute videos. Which is a long time if you... No more sex jokes. F this is a great step for creators that are fed up with the strict and stupid rules that YouTube has implemented lately. For example, my videos never appear as recommended videos and I'm waiting for monetization since November last year. Thank you, YouTube! So we need competition for YouTube. There's only one problem with IGTV. All the videos have to be vertical. Because as the CEO of Instagram, Kevin Shistorm... Shistrom. Oh, right, sorry. Kevin Shistorm, he said... Think about it. Today we still watch videos formatted for a TV on a vertical screen, which means we either have to rotate our phone awkwardly or watch a tiny little version, and that doesn't make much sense, does it? Really? That's why you made all IGTV videos vertical? Because it's awkward to rotate your phone? It's awkward to do this? This is awkward for you. You wanna see something awkward? You wanna see and if I want to film with my Blackmagic camera and on my phone, I have to rotate the camera now? I don't even have a tripod for doing this! This is normal. Stupid. Normal. Stupid. Normal. Better yet, let's make all cinema screens vertical, because otherwise it's awkward. Dumbass shitstorm. Sistrom. Shut up. Shitstorm. Sistrom. Just say Sistrom one more time! Yeah. Mother f Sister. Oh, you son of a How would this show look in vertical mode? If I talk about Trump or the Romanian government, you might think I'm okay with them. But if you go to the normal horizontal mode, you can see how I actually feel about them. Plus, your eyes are horizontally placed. That's why all the screens and monitors are made the way they are. For vertical screens, your eyes should be placed like this. Yeah, th this, uh, this isn't awkward. So yeah, until IGTV doesn't support horizontal videos, it will never be a true competitor for YouTube. <sighs> well, my sunglasses are useless now. The death of memes is upon us. Remember when I said that net neutrality was horrible and I hope that nothing like that will come to the EU? The good news is that net neutrality won't come to the EU just yet. The bad news is something worse is coming. Last week the European Parliament has voted to approve controversial changes to the copyright law and if they are applied the internet will change and not in a good way. Article 13 of the proposed EU copyright directive would force platforms such as Reddit, Facebook or YouTube to examine and censor user content in case it breaches copyright. Now, don't get me wrong, I'm all for the artists getting paid and recognized. But this law is made specifically for politicians before the European elections so that people won't use their photos to make funny or insulting memes about them. But it affects all online content. If the law passes, it will be the death of all memes across Europe. It will be a... Meme apocalypse. Can you imagine the internet without memes? Without Pepe the Frog, this pervert, or Drake? Ah, oh, I'm so curious about what he's looking at. In short, <clears throat> Article 13 will impose widespread censorship of all content you share online. Be it a parody video, a remix, a meme, a blog post, comments on Reddit, a piece of code, live streaming your gaming experience, or even a link in a tweet. The EU's new copyright proposal will be a disaster for the internet. The dark ages of the internet are upon us. This is like the plague of the internet. If this law is applied, my videos will look like this. The new S10 from S will have the latest processor and will battle for smartphone supremacy with 
let's call it as it is. It's censorship that pretends to protect the creators when in fact it destroys creativity. If you're a European citizen and you want to stop this from happening, there's a site called saveyourinternet.eu where you can email your representatives in the European Parliament and ask them to vote against Article 13. Who wouldn't like to be memed? It's all just for fun. It's... Yeah, that, that, that's nice. <laughs> that, that's not funny. For real, it, it's, it hurts. The 2019 S10 leaks. Let's talk about what rumors and leaks we have about the next year's Galaxy S10 because they're popping up like cars in front of Chuck's bike. Yo, Chuck, how many times has a car hit you? Cars have hit him on his bike six times. Starting to think it's not their fault, Chucky boy. Who's a bad cyclist? You're a bad cyclist. Oh, yes, you are. Oh, yes, you are. Next year's Galaxy S model will feature a more accurate face scanning system thanks to a new 3D face detection technology and thus it will drop the iris scanner for a more secure unlocking feature. In other words, the Korean version of Face ID. Bezels will probably still exist, but Samsung will try to make them as small as possible and will most likely have a fingerprint sensor under the display, which I think is cool and it will give it a cleaner look on the back. It's rumored that the S10 will support the Qualcomm Snapdragon 855 processor and just like the iPhone rumors, there might not be two versions, but three versions of the S10. Two 5.0 inch models, one with a single camera and one with a dual camera setup and the 6.2 inch with the triple rear camera setup. Ooh. Ah. Oh my god. How many? Three. How many? Three. Somebody found out that the Huawei P20 Pro has the highest camera score with those three cameras. And last but not least, it might not have a headphone jack. <laughs> of course, they are all rumors. Some of them might be true, some of them not. But I can't wait to see how it looks. And I pray to Liam Neeson it won't have a notch. As for the jack. <laughs> This is the show. Thanks again very much for watching. Remember to subscribe, share this with your friends, give a like. I'm John. Until next week, keep it safe and secure. Cheers. This is stupid. Right now, you can't see the awesome stuff that's happening in the left and the right side of the screen. For real, it's, it's awesome. If this wouldn't be vertical, you could enjoy the awesomeness that's happening right now. You want to see it? It's awesome. Are you ready? Are you ready? Okay, I'm going to show it to you. See? Awesome. Uh, because I'm awesome. And three of me is three times awesome.